Hi, I'm Chad Staples and I'm the senior curator here at Featherdale Wildlife Park. And we've been using GE ultrasound equipment as a diagnostic tool for better preventative medicine with our animals. In particular, looking into koalas and the disease chlamydia and the early diagnosis of it. So chlamydia, although it almost sounds like a joke because it is a sexually transmitted disease that people get, is very, very serious in koalas. You're talking about the possibility of rendering that animal sterile and very worst case scenario is that it can actually lead to death. Here you go, girls. Dinner. Hi, Willow. Here she is. Any ultrasound can be used on humans or animals. There's no specific system that's designed just for humans or just for animals. At least I can ask the humans to stay still. I never thought that I would be scanning koalas. Every time I come, I learn something new and that's what I find so rewarding about my job. The ability to look at the koala's ovaries is going to help us potentially better diagnose chlamydia. And it's very exciting to see the results that we're getting. We're looking for changes in their reproductive system, so changes to their uterus, their bladder walls and their ovaries. Because we have such a high frequency transducer, that's why we get such good image detail. And when you're looking for a disease such as chlamydia in the ovaries, it's very important that you can get the best image quality possible. I think it's amazing how easily Featherdale Wildlife Park have taken to using the ultrasound machine. Prior to the ultrasound, a lot of it really was guesswork. It's very exciting to see the different animals and the results that we're getting and I think this is going to aid in the early diagnosis. OK, I think we've got everything we need there. So it looks like you're all clear, Willow. She was a great patient. <laughs> Thank you, Willow.